Yeah, I'm having a hard time hearing. Yeah, me too. Bob, you're also quiet. I'm quiet? Yep. You couldn't hear anything? No, you want to start over? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> uh, good afternoon. Can you hear me now? Yes. You're pretty low. Yep. I'm still low? <laughs> Good afternoon. Uh, welcome to this an historic preservation commission meeting dated June 22nd at 4 p.m. My name is Robert Clark. If every member of the committee could just state their name for uh, the, the record. Marnie Williams. Bill Sabara. Uh, we will start the meeting. Um, we are here to hear case number 10-20-173 Pleasant Street. The applicant is Addis Razek. Uh, Mr. Razek, hopefully I'm saying that right. If I didn't, I apologize, is seeking to construct a 240 square foot metal carport in the rear of his property, the rear side of the property. Uh, the party, uh, I can't hear you. Uh, Patty, you still there? Yep. Yeah. Uh, uh, I can't. Hear you. Can you hear me? His, his phone, whenever he comes on, we get that massive background chatter. Yeah, I just muted it and that improved it. Oh, there you go. Um, anyway, sorry for that. Uh, the applicant is looking to construct a 240 square foot carport two feet from the rear of his property. He has gone and received a variance. The variance was for a maximum carport size of 220 square feet. So he received a variance for an additional, I believe, 20 square feet uh, for the carport. Uh, at this time, if the applicant would like to uh, say a few words about the project. Uh, my property, is, uh, I would like to say hello to everyone. Uh, I would like also to say that my property doesn't have any garage, garage on the property or I cannot put my car in there, you know, all night. And I would, the cheapest way for me was carport, and the standard carport purchase at the office. Mr. So, Razor? Yes. Are you using your computer? Mr. Razor? Yes. Using your computer to. I cannot understand what you say. Because yes, we can. It's breaking. I understand what you're coming in muffled. If you're using your telephone, your no, I'm, I'm using my song laptop. Your what? My song laptop. So, do you mind if I just speak on your behalf as to what you said at the zoning board? Zoning board meeting, uh, Mr. Rezik stated that he um, has a new car. He doesn't have a garage. He's looking to put up this carport. Um, 
Brian will pull up the picture of what it's going to look like. You'll see um, he has it outlined as to where it's going to go in his yard. Um, this photo also shows it's sideways, but what the carport is going to look like. It's just one of those ones you purchase at Lowe's or Home Depot. And, um, you know, he's going to construct it that way. He said he may put on sides um, just to the, to the two outside, the long sides, not, you know, so he can drive in still. Um, the zoning board did require that he paint it to match the house if he puts sides on it. He wasn't sure if he was going to at this time or not. But he, um, <clears throat> Brian, if you pull up the other photo, set of photos. The Mark Tupperware ones? Yeah. I'm sorry. Right. Oh, actually, this is fine. I just meant it was on the same page. You can see from there where he's going to put it. Um, he's outlined it with that tarp. He put the tarp on so that you could see. Okay. So he can take the photos as to where the carport is going to go. Um, he did receive a variance for the size, 220 is what's permitted. He is looking for 240, and he also received a variance for the setbacks, and he's proposing um, two feet from the rear and the side property line. Um, in his neighbor's garage, um, he stated that is within 200, two feet of his property line right now, and the neighbor doesn't have any issue with his carport. Patty, is that the house we see right there? Is that his yeah. house? Yeah. Okay. And what color would the carport be? The car well, the metal, it has a metal roof, and then if he decides to put sides on it, the zoning board, re um, their request was to make it match the house. Okay. Are there any images of what that airport looks like? Who was that? We didn't understand what you were saying. That, that's Phil. I said, are there any uh, photos or images of what that car uh, looks like? Any photos of what it's going to look like? Um, well, there's that one. It's sideways. Okay. I know. I don't get that. <laughs> Photo is sideways. You can rotate it. There you go. Oh, okay. That's better. Yeah, but then now this. Yeah, I know. So, Patty. Uh, yeah. So, Patty, the. Where we see those those black box lines, there's that's just see through. There's no siding there. No, not not right now. There is not. That's the way you purchase it. Okay. If, what what color is the frame and the metal roof? Color is the metal roof. Yes. Yeah. Metal. Right. From the look of that, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't believe they're coming to. I think they're proposing a Future complex going I think he went to get a picture. We can't hear you. Can you type in the area where it says for chat? You hit top Put your telephone. Right. Or is there any way that you can? Uh. <laughs> 
The roof is going to be great. Can you mute your picture? picture? Or can you mute no, your all right, thanks. Just leave it muted. There we go. Take it every So, is the frame black and the roof gray? Is that what I'm understanding? Yeah. Can that be painted to match the house, or can there they get a different color uh, metal roof? Well, you're kind of hard to understand. He's wondering if yes, if it could, if the roof could match the house. You want it painted to match the house? I, I mean, you're going to see it from Pleasant Street. That's my concern, and I, I think it should probably at least blend in or work with the house. Can, can you bring yeah. it up? Yeah. What color is his roof? Looks gray. Uh -huh. Are you waiting for a response? Yes. It's gray. <laughs> it's gray. Okay. Well, what about the frame? Could that be painted white? I'm sorry, we can't understand you. What'd you say, Phil? I, if the roof is gray in, on the existing house, I, I guess I could live with that. Um, I think I'd prefer, since all the trim on that house is white, if they could paint the frames white so they're not black. I think those colors would, would be fine. You want the supports white rather than black? I think that would look much better. Okay. Yeah, I would agree. I agree with Phil. Yeah, yeah I agree too. And keep the roof gray. Yeah. Yes. What what color gray? I mean, it's not like a charcoal gray, is it? <laughs> what? I mean, it's it's not like a black, like a dark gray. If it's a if it's close to the color of the existing roof, I think yeah, that would be fine. So match the existing roof color. Well, I, I'm just saying it doesn't have to necessarily match it, but at least be close to it. Okay. <clears throat> Anybody else have any other questions? Now, if he were to um, if he were to get the sides, then will he be using the tan color for the sides or white? I mean, I think that's directed towards Phil. Um, to I guess anybody. I mean, would you go with the beige the tan for the sides if you were to put sides up because it's said to match with the existing house uh, I, so. agree, I agree with you marnie okay <coughs> we didn't catch that phil what was that I, I agree with marnie i think uh it should you know match the house if, if they put sides on it and the okay. ap applicant just notated that he's fine with that Okay. Okay, so the support poles will be white. The roof will be close to the same color as the house roof. And if you put sides on it, then it should be close to the match of the house. Correct? Yes. yes. Okay. Does anybody want to make a motion? I motion to approve based on those uh, criteria. I don't okay. understand you. Sorry. Bill made a motion. Bill made a motion to approve as presented. I made a second. Uh, all okay. those in favor, say aye. 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 Opposed. Okay. Carry. You, Mr. Razik, you're all set. You have to get a permit through code. 
Um, and you can call their office tomorrow. The number is 315-792-0163. Is there any other uh, business we have? Or are we all set, Patty? Nope, we're all set. All right, everyone have a good night. You too, thank you. Thank you. You too. Bye-bye.